Hey friends, if DaVinci Resolve is not working on your Windows system, then please watch this video. I will guide you through the resolutions. So the first resolution is to launch the app as an administrator. Search for DaVinci Resolve in the Windows search bar, right click on it and select run as administrator. The next solution is to download a stable version and I'll explain what it means. So if you search for DaVinci Resolve in the search bar, a Windows or any player and go to its download page and then click on the DaVinci Resolve icon you'll notice that it has a public beta version and then a studio version the stable version so the one which is uh, the earlier build is usually the stable one and the one which is later built is the public one so I suggest you to download the stable one because that is short work and the beta one it has new features but it is not necessarily a stable build the next solution is to check the system requirements for DaVinci Resolve and this is very important considering the fact that DaVinci Resolve is a video editing software it is a heavy software so search for DaVinci Resolve system requirements and then here are the system requirements so you should have windows 10 creators update or higher and you should have an intel core i7 pc which is very high i mean uh davinci resolve will work with i5 but it won't work well 16 gb of ram or more and these are the minimum requirements 4 gb of vram or uh, which means that you will have to get an external gpu and an ssd drive if preferable so uh, the system requirements are pretty high and that is why you need to be sure of the system requirements uh, when trying to launch DaVinci Resolve. It doesn't work on my other computer but it works on my gaming computer. Then you can update your graphics card driver. So search for device manager in the window search bar and open device manager. Now scroll down to the display adapters right click on the first display adapter and select update drivers right click on the second display adapter and select update drivers right this will fix the problem for most of the users but if it doesn't then you can obviously reinstall the davinci resolve software right click on the start button select settings from the menu go to the apps tab go to installed apps now Click on the three dots associated with DaVinci Resolve and select uninstall. Then you can uh, go to the website and download and uh, install the stable version on your computer. I will suggest the stable version. Was this helpful? If yes, then please let us know in the comment section of this video. Thank you for watching this video and have a nice day.